In today's video, I wanted to prank Melon with an innocent TNT trap, but ended up blowing myself up. Everyone makes mistakes now and then, but this time, it was his last. Once I got exploded, I was visited by Death himself, and he told me that I could never respawn again. Sonny, bro, where are you? Quickly, goats, press the like and subscribe button so I can contact Melon. Huh? Was that Sonny? Uh, hey, Melon, you're not gonna believe this. All right, Sonny, I'm off to Melanie's. Wait, you're gonna leave me alone all day here? Uh, hold on, let me think about it. Uh, yes, I am. See ya. Ah, uh, goats, I'm gonna have the most awesome movie marathon with Melanie. It's gonna be awesome. This is perfect. I actually wanted Melon to leave, because now I can enjoy some TV time. And more importantly, I've been wanting to order this brand new TNT. It's a special pranking TNT that I can use on Melon. Yep. Just gotta submit the order and buy. One hour later. Yes, that's the door. And I bet it's my new package. I really hope this pranky TNT works. Oh, what the heck? Regular TNT. Oh, well, I'll still make the most of it. Let's see. Where would I prank him? Maybe I put it underneath this couch. Nah, he doesn't sit here too often. What about in the basement? Anything down here that would be good? Mm, maybe in our secret hideout? Nah, too obvious. Wait a second. I've got it. I'm gonna prank the kitchen. Melon's always hungry. So the next time he goes to the fridge, it's gonna go kaboom. All I need is my pickaxe, gravel, and pressure plate. Now watch this. I remove two blocks and I place the TNT in the hole, followed up with a gravel block and a pressure plate. And you might be wondering why the gravel. And I'll show you why. Because I'm gonna dig underneath and remove it so that he falls in this giant pit of doom. Oh. Oh, yes, I know. I'm actually a genius. And then let's just patch up the hole. All that's left to do now is wait for Melon to come home. All right, Melody. That skibbity movie was awesome. But I think it's about time I head home. Uh, psych! <gasps> Melody, we've got at least three more movies to watch. Oh, yeah. I'm so excited to watch Skibbity episodes 54, 55, and 56. And the movie Marathon. Yep, it's gonna be awesome. Many hours later. Bro! Where is Melon? It's been so many hours, and look! It's now late at night and he's still not home. Dang it. Oh, I'm starting to get really tired. I'll wait a little bit longer. Five hours later. Oh, this is ridiculous. Where is Melon? Oh, and I'm starting to get really hungry myself. I need a snack. I need something to hold me over until he's back home. Oh no, I'm an idiot. I forgot. Ow. Well, it's a good thing I could respawn. I'll have to set the trap back up again. Let's Let's build it. Ah! What are you doing here, Death? Whoa, relax, Sonny. You stopped me the last time, remember? <laughs> I know! I know, but why are you here? Um, you're dead, Sonny. Duh. And I'm death, so it kind of makes sense for you to meet me. Wait, what do you mean I'm dead? Don't I just respawn in Minecraft? Yeah, about that. You've used up all of your lives, so you won't be respawning this time. Sorry about that. <laughs> Oh, what time is it? Oh. oh, hey, Melon. You fell asleep when we were watching those Skibbity episodes. Oh, really? Oh, man, how many videos did we watch? We watched all of Skibbity, all the Fast and Furious, and all of the Toy Story movies. We watched a lot of movies. I should probably head back now. My brother probably misses me or needs some help or something. Sonny. Terrible prank, by the way. You ended up falling for your own trap. Yo, Death, give me a break. It wasn't supposed to go down like that. Besides, how did you even see me fail? Sonny, I'm literally dead all the time, so I have nothing better to do. Oh, look, here comes the watermelon. Where is that sun, boy? Melon! Melon! Where were you all night? I ended up slipping and falling into TNT and dying and exploding, and now Death's- He's not even listening to me. Yo, Melon, acknowledge me, bro. Brother, where are you? Oh, looks like he's not home. That means I get to chill. Wait, can he not see me? What is he doing? 
Gonna make some food and eat it. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, cooked pork chops. I don't even have to make food. Melon, I'm right behind you. And how does he not see the giant hole in the ground? Whoa, why is there a giant hole in our house? Seems pretty dangerous. Let me go patch that up real quick. This should do the trick. Eh, uh, yep, good enough. What the heck is he doing? He just put our Lego head as the block to cover up the hole. You know what? I, I don't understand. Now it's time for my favorite part of the day. Time Time to look up some watermelons. Mm, yeah, that one looks pretty ripe and good to eat. But I, I would never eat a watermelon. I'm just saying, like, you know, it's got the little spot on the bottom. That means it's been ripening on the vine. Yep, they did a good job growing that one. Guys, are you serious? This is what Melon does all day when he's by himself. He just researches more watermelons. All right, that's enough watermeloning. I know how to farm them perfectly now. So, it's time I tend to my patches. This is the most ridiculous thing ever. He can't see me or death. Bro, how can I come back to life? I need to talk to my brother again. I love watermelons. They're so awesome. If anyone touches them, I'll kill them. Brutally! He is kind of messed up, guys. Melon! Melon, I'm right here! How can he not see me? Bro, listen to me. Listen! I'm over here. I need your help. And the last watermelon has been harvested. It's time to go put them in my chest downstairs. I love watermelons. Oh, guys, it's getting a little late. I should probably head to Melanie's for my next movie marathon. Melon, Melon, I'm right here. Take me with you. I want to watch movies. Yeah, this is hopeless. Dang it. Wait a second. Where'd death go? Oh, dude, where is he? Over here, Sonny. Very cool, death. Just make yourself at home, why don't you? Well, yeah. Why not? I'm dead. I can go anywhere. Can you just tell me how I can respawn again? This is getting ridiculous. Well, if you want to come back to life, you just have to get the last person who saw you to say your name. So I just need to get Melon to say the word Sunny? If he says your name, you should come back to life. Or at least that's the first step. Oh, the first step. I should have known this would be complicated. How am I supposed to get Melon to say my name when he won't even acknowledge me? He can't see me. He can't hear me. Well, why why don't you try some subliminal messaging? Subliminal messaging? What is subliminal messaging? Subliminal? Subliminal? You know what, Sonny? I just can't deal with you. Why don't you just write your name in it? Well, why didn't you just start with that? Thank you, Death. Now, let's spell my name. All caps, so it's super obvious. And where should I leave this? Let's see. Let's see. <gasps> Over by his watermelons, of course. Right there. And to get Melon to pay attention to his patches a little more quickly. Check this out. I'm gonna move a pumpkin over there. This ought to get his attention for sure. Right there. All that's left to do now is wait. Dude, I haven't seen my brother in a while. I wonder what he's doing. Wait a second. What is that? Why is there a pumpkin on my farm? Who did this? Who dare did this? There's a note here? What the heck? Yes. Melon, read it. Read the note. It says S-U-N-N-Y. Oh my gosh, this buffoon is spelling it out. Just say all the letters together as one word. S-U-N-N-Y. I wonder what it stands for. Someone under names of names you. Oh, wait. It just says Sonny. Let's go. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Sonny, what are you doing? And where'd your glasses go? And why are you invisible? Getting you to say my name was only the first step. You're dead, Sonny? Yeah, it's a long story, Melon. I didn't even know you could die in Minecraft. Why don't you just respawn? We run out of lives eventually, and then you gotta do this whole process. Uh, Sonny, what do we do next to get you back? Let me ask Death. Hey there, buddy old pal. Step one complete. I can now communicate with Melon. But what are we supposed to do next? Um, Sonny, who are you talking to right now? I'm talking to Death. You don't see him? Uh, no, there's literally no one there. You're talking to the house wall, right? right here. That's what it looks like. No, Melon, he's he's literally right there. He's right in front of you. Uh, Sony, I think you're going crazy. Bro, you're literally looking right at him, and he's looking at you. Mm, nah, quit the cap, bro. Quit the cap. Oh, yeah. Melon can't see me because he's not dead. Anyways, 
If you want to get back to life, you have to go to the Soul Valley. Melon, we've got to go to the Soul Valley. If it means reviving you, Sonny, I'll do anything. Oh, really? That's actually pretty surprising. I thought you were going to run away like a coward and say, I don't want to go to the Soul Valley. Nah, Sonny, I'm a melon of honor. Just, uh, I just got to find something in the house real quick. Real quick. Ah! I don't want to go! Death! Teleport us! Teleport us! Well, Melon, we made it to the Soul Valley. Are you kidding me? I didn't want to do this, Sonny. Yeah, you did. You said you wanted to save me. I'm your brother. Well, I'm staying right here, Sonny. Good luck reviving yourself. Wait, what? You're not gonna help? No, I'm gonna cry in this corner. This place is very scary. Then you're gonna be stuck here forever, and you'll never be able to grow watermelons again. Or watch movies with Melanie. I'm not growing watermelons again. I can't imagine doing that! Sonny, it's time to Parkour! No way. You're an absolute monster at this! Uh, yeah! Uh, what do I do now? Oh, I don't know. Uh, uh yep. Uh, okay. Oh, wait. I could just fly. Yeah, Sonny, you're a literal ghost. Can you figure out how I beat this level already? I'm not sure, bro. But maybe I have to go through this wall. Uh, Melon? I'm on the other side! It looks like there's vanishing blocks! Uh, well, Sonny, can you please interact with them? Because I'm stuck over here! Oh, yeah. I'm a ghost. And these are ethereal blocks. I can make them vanish! There we go. Sonny, you actually did it! I'm at the next level! Now, which way do you want to go? Right or left? Well, you're a ghost. Why don't you just go get rid of the vanishing blocks and tell me which way I should go? All right, well, let's start with the left. There appears to be a chest. Ooh, that means I'm going to the left, Sonny. You better be goaded stuff inside. I got a fire charge. What am I going to do with that? We'll find out soon enough, Melon. But your next objective appears to be in this wall. It's another chest, Sonny. I wonder what I need. Oh, it's just another fire charge. I'm really confused. Well, let's just head on forwards and see what's over here. Sonny, I'm almost there. You're a little bit faster than me as a ghost. Oh, yeah. I can fly. Ah, but I've made it. Move, Sonny. I gotta grab this chest right here. Whoa. Emerald armor and a knockback ironwood sword. And another fire charge. I wonder what this armor's for, though. Whoa. This looks kind of cool, but uh, there's literally nothing here. Uh, bro, death is literally right in front of you. Sonny, can you stop capping, brah? No, he's right here. Look, I'm gonna talk to him. Hey, Death, so we're in the Soul Valley, and now we made it all the way to this thing that looks pretty creepy. What do we do now? Um, you have to light up the three Soul Sands, but you have to do it really fast. Don't question anything. Just do it quick. Also, stand in the middle. Okay, so Melon, what Death said to do is light up the Soul Fires. Oh, really? It's that easy? All right, one, and... Uh, actually, Sonny, are you sure we should do this? Kind of don't trust death after what happened last time. Good point, Melon. Hey, death. Are you sure we could trust you, bud? Oh, yeah, yeah. You can totally trust me. Like, totally. Now, please, just light it up, yeah? Yeah, Melon, it's fine. You can light it. All right, Sonny. It's lit! I'm alive! Congratulations, Sonny. I thought I'd never see the day. But, um, death? Uh, why could I see you? Ha! Thank you, Melon, for bringing me to the world of the living once again. And now I'll kill you. Ah! <sighs> Melon, where are we? Something tells me death is lurking right around the corner. Let's try and even the score. I shall collect your souls now and have just enough energy to conquer all of Minecraft. Oh yeah, death? Get a load of this! I've had a dynamite on me the whole time! Um, Sonny, he looks really mad right now. Quickly, take this! Melon, kill him! I can't get to that armor! All right, Sonny, I'll distract death! And I've got it! Thanks for the power-up! Okay, Sonny, he's doing a lot of damage, bro. I need some backup. Yeah, I'm slicing him in the little feet, sees. I got him. He's no match for Sonny and Melon. The ultimate wombo combo. Oh, no. I'm at four hearts, but death is even lower. Come on! I'm on three hearts, but I won't give up. We did it! Whoa, what's going on? We did it. We're finally back home. And nothing could possibly go wrong. Plus, we've got this awesome armor. Ooh, fresh mail. It's a notebook. I wonder what it says. D E A T H. Hey, Melon, what does that spell? Sonny, I've seen this before. Don't do it. Don't do it. Death? 
Wait, what is this spell? Oh no! I will destroy all of Minecraft, unless you like and subscribe. Last time on Sunny and Melon. Why don't I ever get to pick where our house gets built? You always make me compromise. I'm done with that, and I'm done with you. Sunny, why don't you just make your own world and get out of here? Sunny left Minecraft forever. Guys, everything has been going awfully recently. Ever since Sunny's left, things have just gone terribly. Maybe I need that guy in my life again. Will Melon survive without Sunny? Stick around and find out. I'm so fed up with you! Okay, chill. Get out of here, bro. You're weird. It's too late. I'm not chilling. I'm gonna go warm up in the desert, and then I'm never coming back. All right, have fun. Okay, guys, I'm not actually that upset, and I'm not gonna leave the game yet. What I need to do now is head back home, sneak into the house, steal all of our diamond blocks, and then go visit Quandale's shop and see what I can buy to prank Melon. I've just gotta be really sneaky. Break fence. Make sure you can't see me anywhere. Oh, guys, I don't know where Melon is. Oh, 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 oh. He's watching TV. He's watching TV. Look at him. Look at him. He's rearranging the furniture. He just deleted my chair. He just destroyed the yellow couch. Oh, Sonny's yellow couch was disgusting. I'm just gonna throw it there and wait for it to despawn. This channel's amazing. Hold on. Let me rearrange these couches. Yes. It's not fair. He always had the optimal couch position. Now I get Get it. Oh, it's beautiful. Guys, I hope Melon doesn't hear this. Ooh, that was close. Yes, he's so dumb. He's watching TV. He's got no idea that I'm sneaking upstairs and taking all of our diamonds. Yes. Yes. So many. You know what? I'll leave him with just one. Now I've got to sneak back down. Uh, yo, look what he's watching. That's so cringe. Gotta get out of here. Close the door. Yes, he didn't notice. Now it's off to Quandale's. <gasps> I love this show. This is my favorite part where the guy is falling into the void and he's still falling into the void. Oh, it's so awesome. Press the video on screen to keep watching. Hurry up before it disappears.